Hello again, Vince here, Hudson Bonsai. Today I've got a Eastern Red Cedar in here, uh, Juniperus virginiana. It's actually a juniper even though it's called cedar, that's fine. Uh, this particular tree, it has, it's a, you know, a decently thick trunk and uh, snap it if it's not bad, but the foliage is particularly compact and nice on this tree. Um, Quite sure this is a male, not a female. There's never been berries on it, and from my experience, it seems that the males have a much nicer, tighter foliage than the females do. The females tend to have more juvenile foliage, and they just tend to be a little bit more leggy. So, I'd say inside here, uh, you know, there is some really nice, tight, compact foliage. I'm going to be Kind of just hacking this thing back today, cleaning it up a little bit on the inside. Uh, this tree was collected probably somewhere between three and four years ago. Uh, it's been growing good and healthy the past couple of years. It was gently repotted this spring. Uh, there really wasn't much collected soil in there, so it wasn't, there's was a little bit left, but it, it wasn't a big deal to repot this thing from the container I had it in. Some of these roots are have kind of ugly stubs on the end, but I know that there's living root coming from the bottom of it. I'll be able to kind of trim that back and hide it eventually. So anyway, uh, get to work. First thing I know for sure is I don't want it this tall. For now, I'm going to go right there. For now, I'm just trying to put it into a general shape. And then I'll go back and do some more fine pruning.
All right, so now that that's gotten a much more kind of reasonable shape, I'll get in there and start to, uh, you know, prune out some more, make some more structural decisions on the inside. I, I, that trailing branch to the side, originally I kind of thought that to be, you know, maybe a, a second leader for the tree. But I'm not so sure that that's what I want to do with that. I think I'm going to kind of work on the main tree first and then decide about that. Uh, it could always be, you know, eventually it's coming from so low on the trunk that it could be left there for a really long time and eventually taking it off without any, you know, kind of risk to swelling or to the structure. It's only going to thicken up the base of the trunk and it could make an interesting gin, I suppose. A close-up of that foliage, as you can see it is really tight and fine, just as good as anything you can find on a juniper. And this is out on the leggy tips of one of those branches. On the inside it's even, even better. start on the inside clearing off for a lot of this uh, small weak or just unneeded foliage stuff that's growing from the crotches of branches or growing straight down or, or straight up Well, maybe we're starting to be able to see a tree in there. I was kind of picturing this as the front. Uh, there are quite a few branches that are actually coming out of the front of the trunk from that angle. This one, this one, eh, this small one, it's kind of insignificant back here. Take this off. All right, well, I think I've taken enough off of this tree for one day or one working, one, one season maybe. Um, let's say this tree was only collected a few years ago and it wasn't really touched at. I maybe pruned off a few really long shoots over the years, but for the most part this has been untouched. So this is really kind of the first uh, working for this tree. And I think uh, 
you know, there's some there's some decent structure in there. I mean, the tree isn't fantastic, but it's got decent taper. It's not very abrupt taper or very, you know, sudden taper. It's gradual, but it's there. I'm not entirely sure how this branch is eventually going to be used, but for now I'm just going to leave it grow. Let it be strong. I'm not, not even 100% on what the front of the tree is. I, I think somewhere in there isn't bad either. And maybe one of these lower branches that's already coming in this direction could be the leader from this side. Maybe this branch would need to go and you know, prune that up a little bit, shorten it. But I think with some, a little bit of work, a little bit of tweaking, that that side could also be a possible front. Today, uh, that's as far as I'm going to take it. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.